Uh, many people are concerned about uh, making their own power. Uh, and yes, selling back the utility is a good thing, but it only works when the utility is up and running. And with an unreliable utility, having a hybrid system is very desirable. We get a lot of calls from people that want a backup. Uh, so if the grid were to go down, they can still power the refrigeration and their essential loads, well pumps, things of that nature. SMA has come up with a, a brilliant microgrid hybrid system. This system can work off-grid entirely. It can also work with the utility if the utility is there to sell extra back to. Um, and so this, it's based on these two inverters here, which are known as Sunny Islands. Each one is 120 volt output, and they're 180 degrees out of phase with one another, creating a 240 volt uninterruptible microgrid. They're hooked into batteries, so these are battery-based inverter. So 24/7, they are uh, power producers. <clears throat> uh, they produce what's called uh, active and reactive power, so that which is unique amongst inverters in, in this uh, class. And that's very special because that's uh, capacitive electricity, resistive electricity, and inductive electricity. They produce the entire spectrum. Most inverters do not. Uh, they can AC couple to a standard SMA Sunny Boy inverter. Uh, these are mass produced here in California and they're very reliable transformerless inverter. We use these all the time. But these do not work if the utility grid goes down. But when they're AC coupled to the output of these inverters, <clears throat> then they do continue to work. And the charging of the battery goes from solar panels to a Sunny Boy inverter, to the Sunny Islands, and then to the batteries. They don't use a charge controller. And uh, you can use uh, advanced batteries with this technology. It's a very regulated charge, just like with an electric vehicle. The charging on those kind of lithium batteries is much better done from AC to DC through a regulated charge. And so these, these inverters are what's known as battery agnostic. They can operate with any of the battery technologies. <clears throat> uh, and our largest job to date using these type of inverters is about 30 kilowatt. It's a combined 12, 12 kilowatt, 6 plus 6 plus 18 kilowatts of Sunny Boy inverters. So that's about 125 amp service off grid. So that's what's required to run you know, a big custom house with pool and well pump and booster pump and septic pump. Uh, this, this technology can do that. This architecture allows us to run very large uh, homesteads. We weren't able to do it in the past. Um, part of the beauty is that the home's using alternating current. These inverters produce alternating current. So we don't have to go through many steps solar to a charge controller to a battery back to an inverter to finally make alternating current. We go solar to a, a string inverter, now we're making alternating current in the off-grid world. So, uh, yes, this, the thing that really makes the SMA system special and, and work so well is that it has a communication protocol. So that when the batteries are full, solar panels are in the sun, and the loads are less than the line production, <clears throat> which would normally be a big problem in an off-grid system. The Sunny web box is the brain of, of the system and it's able to manage that power. And the Sunny Boy inverters can throttle back, they force the solar panels to work closer to their open circuit voltage, produce less power until the compressor or pump, some other load comes on to balance. And then immediately the power that's produced from the solar panels is allowed to come into the system. So it, it has that communication protocol, it, it has that control system. None of the other manufacturers have that.